again. I uh, apologize about the errors. Uh, we have some trouble sometimes when we get in all this set up for Twitch and all that jazz. So uh, we're coming at you live. So stay tuned. We're going to have an awesome show here for you. Oh, yeah. um, and besides our intro and crazy tangents and whatever problems that may arise, our first segment is always Drink of the Day. D-O-T-D. Drink of the Day. Today's Drink of the Day is brought to us by GCL Honorary Mom, um, Lisa Nessler. At the Lisa day. Nessler, that's a double S-L-E-R. Um, yeah, at Lisa Nessler suggested this double Drink S of the Day. Well. No, N-E-S-S-L-E-R. It's a double S-L-E-R. Oh, I thought she said double... Okay, Ness, uh, for all you Nintendo fans out there, Ness, yeah. Ness, L-E-R. L-E-R. Yeah. There we go. We've Ness, that. L-E-R. Um, and it's Earthbound, which is also uh, Mother, which connects. Uh, GCL Mother, also from the game Mother. Wow, talk about... Look at that, deep. making connections all over the fucking map. Did like you like the snaps? snaps? <laughs> yeah, I felt nice. like really like... <laughs> A little bit flamboyant, but a little bit myself. That so, Cole, nice. you're, you're bringing a lot of ingredients here. What, yeah, are we, yeah. uh, what are we partaking in today? Um, so, the first thing that I brought out is, as you guys may recognize if you are regular uh, listeners or tuners in. We may um, have had this before. This is the Line and Kugel's Cran Gin Shan, Cranberry Ginger Shandy. I like that um, name. The, cool. uh, I think we brought it up. Cran Gin Shandy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, it sounds like a dojo name or something. Um... Uh, what we're making today is a mixed drink. It is called the Moscow Mule. Um, it calls for a ginger beer, but liquor store is out of ginger beer, so brought back a regular. We will we will make do. It, yeah, we're, something uh, good at least. The uh, the Landrosoft tool. Well, <laughs> no, I wanted to know what you were gonna say. Uh, Land- I got it. Okay, you got Zach it. Zach can take All it. All right. Uh, he's talking about the Landrosoft twist. Oh, yeah, that's the, uh, the cranberry. It's his his way of like. Oh, innovative. spicing it up. Yeah. yeah, because Cole's all about that extra flavor. Mm. It's true. You guys want to... Anybody that... that. Yeah. Sorry, right. so we need a... Are we filling with ice? It's or definitely serving with ice. Yeah, yeah, just a few. I'm going with four because... Fuck the police. Not a part of this system. You're so hard to I think I want one more. So yeah, the ingredients... Uh, other than the line and cool, um, we have um, vodka... Okay. Um, this vodka we are having today is the new Amsterdam vodka, uh, 40%, um, five times distilled. Cool. Oh, wow. They 100%, really 100% pure grain neutral spirits. That's a big ass bottle, I do it have to is say. a huge yeah. bottle of the you ass. So you can finish it first? <laughs> that would be you. I would probably. <laughs> definitely have a problem. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. You I have, have a, a list skill. of problems. No, it's not, you it's, skill. It, oh, it's scientifically not a problem if you admit it, so... Uh, That's true. The first step to recover your whatever. Is wouldn't that admitting, admitting you have a problem, so you would have a problem? But then the problem is no more. I forgot the jigger, so I'm just gonna wing it. Um, yeah. So we have the ingredient number one, ginger beer. Ingredient number two, vodka. How much are we talking like? Measurements? How big of a drink do you want? Are we talking like an ounce or two of vodka? Or are we yeah. just? Well, okay. we left the jigger out of the situation gotcha. today. Don't we're just gonna make we're it gonna and see it. how it works. We're gonna do how every drink I make. I just wing the wing the parts, <laughs> and usually it turns okay. out well. Yeah. So are we like adding a. a it is also served with a lime. So huh? um, I can cut the lime if yeah, you want to get. Uh, I'll start going there. Start the pouring. Okay. Beer and ice. What do you guys think about that? It's, gonna it's be interesting. Not uh, very common. You know, Strongbow that we had last week is actually suggested over ice. Really? Yeah. Huh. In the commercials, it says, please enjoy over ice. Because I guess it is uh, apple juice. an apple, yeah, <laughs> basically <laughs> apple juice. <laughs> but yeah, um, I don't know, beer over ice. I haven't personally had it before. Like, I've never really been desperate enough to either put my warm beer over ice. It or... hydrates you yeah. all while getting you drunk at the same time. Wow. Something I should do GCL more GCL hot tip. <laughs> <laughs> Always put ice in your beer. My, my lime smells so good. It really does. My hands are gonna smell great. Yeah, dude, I'm gonna smell your hands. Wow, look at show. that part pouring. You got it three parts equal. Just about. I mean, hell yeah. Check that out. Look at that. So if you ever need a part pour um, slash bartender for any kind of function, just give Cole a ring. A diamond ring. Shine bright like a diamond. That, that. I'm glad this isn't a music talk show. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just kidding. You're, you're talented at music. It doesn't show, but 
I know I'm, I, it goes on in my head and that's all I care about. <laughs> it, at the very least, my musical talent entertains me. There you <laughs> go. That's all it really needs to do. Yeah. You make music for yourself and other people like it. There you go. Oh, did you not pour the vodka? Okay. <laughs> the only one I did. <laughs> Thanks though, Josh. I appreciate it. Oh yeah. man, that lime does smell so good. No, are we squirting some lime in there to uh, enhance uh, the flavor? I'm gonna squirt some just... lime and just drop it for a slice. That's that's what I would do to mine yeah. personally. There you go. Um, if you want to just that. garnish it with a lime, um, that's also acceptable. Um, All right, here's a knife if you want. Thanks. Oh, I just got the piece. But if you want the big piece, go for it. Did you get one? Yeah. I oh, okay. I put one. Yeah, I think I one. Love line. All right. Thank you. Going for a smell test here. I always start with a smell test. It, it smells like the lady. GCL, GCL, GCL drink of the day segment with a hint of lime in it. it. Smells pretty good. I like it. Yeah, I, I like the smell so far. We'll see what the taste is. Cheers, boys. Cheers. Yeah, I gotta smell it. Oh, okay. Well. Okay. <laughs> okay. Hmm. Not a whole lot of flavor. My first impression. It um. Hmm. It's interesting. <clears throat> it is. Hmm. It's a lot more bitter than I was expecting. It yeah, is, it is very bitter. That must be from the vodka. I gave Zach a little extra because I know you like it. <laughs> so. Um, the vodka in the lime, okay. <laughs> I got a little bit of a, a tinge, like in the back of your jaw. Yeah, like right here. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, right in the back. Right on your lymph nodes, um, I have cancer all over them. I don't have cancer. <laughs> Not yet. Hmm. It's an easy drinker. I'll, I'll say that. Yeah, like, it is. Bad. I, you... I wish it had, like, a little bit more of fruitiness to it. Yeah, I, I yeah. Like, that, drinking a mixture. I mean, that's I me for, for everything. <laughs> Yeah, like uh, maybe almost like a cherry hit to it. If it was like a cherry rum, okay, be, or a cherry vodka, mm -hmm. that could be good. Oh yeah. Like, what about a coconut rum? I'm not a coconut guy. I wouldn't like that. Yeah, rum I'll tell you, it's just the consistency. But wouldn't be a Moscow mule if it was <laughs> rum, probably. I'm, I'm, I just yeah, no. probably be like a Caribbean mule or something. Vodka. That's something I don't know. Like usually for people, coconut, it's the, it's the consistency thing. Mm -hmm. I can't do either. I can't do taste. Really? I can't do consistency of it. It just I like it more with another lime. I usually okay, really. Yeah, that's nice. I, I really like lime. Another though. lime. Love yeah, lime. Me too. Love. Lime. It's like probably my first favorite citrus. I might add another slice to mine. I'd have to go with orange just because oh, I feel like orange is so much more versatile with. I mean, like orange juice and just the flavors you do with orange. Yeah. Lime always has that that tartness that isn't as universal as orange. Okay. That's yeah. me. True that. Personally. And what is it? Oh, did you? I read the other day. Uh, smelling an orange reduces stress by seventy percent. Really? Just the smell of orange. Mm -hmm. Huh. That's why I guess orange scents are so. I guess uh, what's the word? I'm like permeated Pleasant. through everything like the dish soaps with orange mm. and like the now can you those. smell anything orange or does it have to be the, pr the fruit uh, i'm assuming it's just orange flavor i don't, I don't remember anything mm. if it's i had like an orange smell shirt. orange orange that is nice and, and i smelled the shirt would i be happier um well happiness is i'm gonna take that anyway, as a yes so. i don't I, ooh, yeah, yeah that's tart now yeah, um, i like that that's good i it's uh interesting it's simple it is. It's, mm -hmm. it's nice and easy. Yeah. It's it's my first uh, like liquor beer mix combination. You know, I was, mm -hmm. that's yeah. That's what, at first, I was like, huh, that's different. Whenever uh, Will first told me, I thought he said ginger root beer, and I was like, oh, okay, that could be root beer vodka. And then he said ginger beer. I was like, huh, okay, maybe we maybe the maybe it's the line of Google, honestly. Could be maybe maybe you need um, more of a thick ginger may, taste. Yeah, maybe 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 the, that's where the, the ginger and vodka mm. needs to mix a little bit better and True. the lime. Maybe could hint. be could um, be. We can always try it again sometime. Yeah, sure. yeah. 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 We but have. We're always down to revisit. Plenty of events. episodes to go. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, haven't gotten there yet. But yeah. As but, far as revisiting. Um. So Moscow Mule is this week's drink of the day. Uh. Don't forget, you can tell us what to drink, just like Miss Nestler did. Uh. Hit us up Hi, on Mom. Twitter. <laughs> At GCL Podcast with use the hashtag D O T D. 
Oh, yeah. uh, and, uh, you can tell us what to try if you've got a mixed drink of your own, a favorite of yours, or, or a beer. Yeah, or, we mix uh, alcohol and beer together, so you know we'll try a lot of different yeah. things. Yeah. 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 Um, but if you just have a favorite beer, you can hit us up, uh, tell us what to try. Uh, we've tried a lot of different things, yeah. and uh, so let us know. Uh, but as for the Moscow Mule, we need scores. We need scores. You know what? I'm going to give it, I, I don't think I would order it in a, in a restaurant, unfortunately. I'm going to give it a 7, though. Still, you were reading my mind, man. Yeah, I was going with a seven, solid seven. Yeah, it's yeah. like it's a good drink. Like it's not anything above and beyond, but mm-hmm. it's got it's got a little bit of flavor to it. It's easy going down. Yeah, uh, on the lime is what makes it for me. Let's see for this what, drink. The twelve ounce. This is a tw- yeah twelve ounce bottle. So we got four ounces of beer and about an ounce of vodka. Okay, maybe two for you, but um, yeah, it's smooth for me. I mean. Yeah, that's, no, and that's it's that's smooth. That's usually the, my highest priority when it comes to drinking. Um, too many bad experiences, too many taste aversion. Uh, <laughs> I, yeah, I just take straight shots and no chasers for the most part. So <laughs> it's like yeah. I used to, I'm used to drinking yeah. whatever I want. Right. Whatever whenever I, I take want. shots, I don't chase because I'm a man. Yeah, whenever I take I shots, I just chase. I'm not drink big, it out, straight out of the bottle. It's not a lot of pleasure. Oh, I know that. Oh, we yeah. saw that two weeks ago. <laughs> um, I was feeling good. <laughs> But for me, I back on? I I want to give it maybe a six. Yeah. Mm-hmm. See, I think we're all about the same agreement here. Yeah. Like it could be better. Sevens all around. <laughs> <laughs> Had I said six five, that would have made sense. And for that, I almost I was thinking literally when you guys said seven, I was like, eh, I'm thinking more of a six five. But I was like, <laughs> no, I got to give it a six, or else I'm gonna get fucked again. <laughs> can't can't win, Josh. Uh, I can never win. Jeez. Um, All right, so Moscow Mule, go pick one up today. Go make one up today. Go make, yeah. Go go pick up the ingredients tomorrow. Mm, so really, the only yesterday. thing, like, you know, ginger beer, not hard to come by. Vodka, really not hard to come by. I don't know, ginger beer, maybe I mean, a little bit hard to come by. Maybe. Uh, yeah, I mean, the, liquor store. the one that I went to didn't have a huge selection. Yeah, this one, mm-hmm. beer. But of course, you know, this is Oklahoma. Yeah, so, so I was so not expecting don't know. a huge selection anyway. Yeah, but if nothing else, if you live in a shitty area where you can't have good liquor or beer on hand, go get a lean and kegel ginger the, which, beer. They aren't terrible. <laughs> they are. Re- I like. I, I like, like them plain. Yeah, yeah no, too. they're great. So we you guys want a next. Uh, we improvise. Maybe after the drink. Yeah. Who knows? Oh, they're over here. Okay, that's fine. So yeah, we improvised with that. So maybe they'll be better. But uh, the way we made them today, Moscow Mule seven, six, and seven respectively. Yeah. Um, so, moving on to our next segment, uh, as you all know, or may not know, now learning, it's always We Can Review. Shoo, 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 shoo. All right, who wants to start it off this week? You went first last week, didn't you? I did you? go last week Start on first. this side. Start on this side, all right. Start on this side. 